Darius, how do you how do you feel your season is going? Uh, I'd say it's going pretty well so far. You, you like you like the offense and that's yeah. being installed. Yeah. I like it. What uh, kind of opportunity is this for you and for some of the other newer receivers with Kadarius out, Kenny out, Chip not really participating for everybody else to showcase? Um, yeah, I mean, I think it's a, a good chance for everybody to get a chance to get a lot of reps. Uh, obviously, show what you can do out here, and we're competing against the defense, so I think it benefits our room as a whole. What, uh, what do you expect? I, this might have been what Biz asked you, and I couldn't hear you, but what do you expect from this offense in terms of, you know, aggressiveness or creativity? Like, what have you, what's your early feel on? Um, I don't really know what, what I would say I expect out of it, but um, I just know it's been a lot of fun to learn it, been a lot of fun to run it so far, and um, I think we're getting better each and every day executing it. For your position to, to really embody that next play mentality when something bad happens and just to move on to the next play? Uh, tremendous, because bad stuff's going to happen sooner or later. You know, Nobody has a perfect career. Nobody has perfect games, perfect days. So. Um, Definitely in our line of work where you're catching all the time and everybody feels like they can catch a ball because they're throwing in their backyard. So when you drop it, you look like an idiot. So, uh, but obviously, you know, reality is we're all human. So um, definitely always got to keep a next play mentality. You and DJ came into the league together and kind of had that instant chemistry right away. You guys have gone through a lot of changes together as well. How much does it help that you and your quarterback have gone through the whole process? so far together? Um, I think it helps a lot because, as you said, the team's changed a lot over the last three years. Um, but obviously having that consistency of the guy that's throwing me the ball, you know, has been helpful for me. And you know, hopefully I've been good for him and helpful for him as well. When a new coach comes in, does your approach change? I mean, do you have to sit there and go, I have to prove myself again or what? Um, no, I think you're always having to prove yourself. You know, whether you have the same coach or new coaches, I think you always want to put your best foot forward and, and show what you can do. Uh, he's quick, he's fast, he's explosive. Um, say he's as advertised. Nobody's faster than me. <laughs> he's fast. Hey, Darren, just, yeah, just out of curious, the, the numbers game uh, on this roster with receivers, there's, there's a lot of receivers for a, not a, an indefinite number of spots. Correct. Are, are you aware of that? Do you think about where your place is on this team? And do you think about if it's not here, that it's going to be somewhere? Uh, not really. I mean, at the end of the day, it's a performance-based business. So no matter how many numbers you have or don't have, if you perform the best, then you'll be in whatever number it is. So, um, you know, I believe in going, coming out here, putting my best foot forward, and, you know, when it all said and done, uh, if I do what I'm supposed to do, I'll be in that number.